If Ogreby can win three first, though, it resets the count completely, and then it's another best of five. And that <coughs> would be an interesting matchup. But right now, we're going to focus. Snake, Roy, back at it again. Last time we saw this, Osiris got the win. Let's see if Ogreby can come back. I'm rooting for Og Ogreby, but let's see what happens. Instantly, an extremely fast-paced match. Yeah, Osiris just kind of throwing these grenades. Snake classic, keeping Ogreby at bay. But uh, Ogreby trying to work his way in there. Found a little bit of success, but only put the... Oh my goodness. <laughs> Osiris just run, jumps and bears him in his face. <laughs> you know... Ooh, this Nikita's gonna be really hard for Roy to get around. He's really far off stage. Yeah, in fact, that'll be the first stock, just like that. One this is exactly down, where you don't want to be against Snake. He loves it when you can just uh, when he can just trade with you. Look how calm Osiris is. He's leaning back still. He's not pressured. He looks at home in this kind of death scenario, but that was actually a that. brilliant trade off stage. Osiris knew that Ogreby was hungry for that kill and made him pay for his greed by just hitting him back to far enough that he wouldn't be able to come back to the stage after he killed him. Yeah, that would be an interesting matchup, but that kind of puts him in a bit of a deficit in my opinion, because now, if Osiris gets, um, if Osiris takes it, wow, that grenade actually game. comboed into the C4, which is really unfortunate. That was a ton of damage Ogreby just suffered for almost nothing. Really smart get up attack there twice. Not gonna fall for any of Osiris' setups off his down throw. Yep, you hear cheers from the crowd. Each one of these guys, they've got their fan favorite. Osiris, by far the fan favorite, coming off the winner's bracket. Really so good able to get it there from no. Ogre B. Ogre B just kind of did a perfect bait. Yeah, Ogre B now that one really patiently, really well. Oh, that's going to be game. Yeah, Snake doing the big oh, split. Osiris going to take the first game out of five. You know, I'm actually surprised that Ogre B didn't open with Ridley, uh, seeing as that was his uh, more successful character last time. Uh, opted to open with the Roy again and uh, down a game because of it. Snake, Snake. 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 Snake, Snake did Ah, uh, you know what? I have seen Ogreby play Snake a few times. I don't think I've seen him try and play Osiris in the Ditto. Uh, this should be interesting. This is going to be an interesting matchup. Snake versus Snake. Osiris Grenade. versus Grenades Ogreby. everywhere. Nikita coming through. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is a gunfight for the ages, folks, here at Dixie State University and the Dixie State Smash Grand Finals. Yeah, definitely an interesting place to try a new strategy of trying to ditto Osiris. Osiris definitely one the probably the local master I'd say of this character. Been playing Snake since the beginning. However, Ogreby seems uh, to have a few tricks of his own as he's got quite a lead here. Yeah, but right now, you know, I guarantee there are going to be some big teams looking at both of these guys. Uh, the university teams, Dixie State University, they, we go D1 next year. We're going to be fighting against some of the best of the best with University of Utah, Utah State. Some okay. amazing gaming teams. I'm excited. This is, in my opinion, a preview of two teammates in the future. I mean, perhaps, I do believe Ogreby is at SUU, though. So Yes, he is. So maybe a potential rivalry, yeah, rivalry in the conference. A bit more likely. Ogreby actually going to take the first stock, uh, to my surprise. Making me keep my words here a little bit, uh, getting a good lead on Osiris. Yeah, and it, starting to grow it. He's starting to get a bigger lead than I've ever, than I've really seen from him. And oh, unfortunate, no. a little bit of an SD there, dude. Such an unfortunate mistake there. But Osiris, 50%. Ogreby could come back. Now up to 64. Ogreby's gonna go. This missile is not going to land. Yeah, Ogreby actually got quite, quite, quite ahead of here. All of a sudden, seemed like it didn't take very long. Osiris tried to cheekily end that stock right away, but wow, that actually killed Snake earlier than I thought it would. Very strong up tilt. You know, maybe Ogre beat him. Maybe this is his strategy. Maybe beat him at his own game. Yes, yeah, saved it all the way for Grand Finals. Didn't even try this in uh, in. 
winners finals. I've seen almost every single one of Ogre B's matches, and not a single one has he used Snake. Wow, this that's... was his ace in the hole. That's pretty impressive that he just can pull out a character that he hasn't played at all in the tournament and is uh, making it look uh, crisp as it ever has been. Wow, absolutely. Osiris already at 77. So, ooh, Nikita looking, hunting. Not quite dead yet, but not far from it. A little bit of a misinput there, I believe, from Ogre B, putting him off stage. Oh, an absolute kick, though, by Osiris. For Ogre B. Oh, really? Oh, that is going to be take it. The stock. Wow. Ogre B ties it up. This is an amazing matchup here, folks. I'm. <laughs> I don't know what Osiris does here. He's just got to make some adjustments, uh, realize, uh, you know what? I play this character, I know what he can do, and uh, make it happen because I don't think he's got another character to fall back on. I really. don't think he does either, so we're are we going to have another double snake matchup. I know we Osiris have. is thinking about it. This is going to go snake, back. Snake, snake. So we are back to the same thing. This could be Ogre B's biggest um, comeback right now. Grand Finals, this is absolutely amazing. Yeah, this is a, a very interesting strategy. It shows me go with here, just mirror matching Osiris here on Osiris' character. Showing him, you know what, I can do it too. Oh no! Great down smash, and the key to follow up. Osiris actually cleans that stock up really early. Yeah, Pilot Osiris went, okay, I can't mess around. I can't do anything right now. I have to get Ogre beat down and out if I want to have a chance of winning this tournament. Great combo there with the grenade that uh, that Ogre B picked up. Yeah, that Knowing was... the timer on it. Another great combo. He's using it so that Osiris can't use a block. Yeah, the... Osiris. I'm not sure what that Nikita plan was. It might have been a misinput. But it does give Ogre B a stock. It's interesting, Snake's uh, high recovery is really hard for Snake to punish. <laughs> Awkward as that is to say out loud. No, it makes perfect sense though, especially in a match where you have two of the exact same characters. And that's an interesting match. Ogre B, he's gonna get knocked out. Osiris still has two stocks left and that's 64%. Ogre B needs to have almost a flawless run in this third game. Yeah, Osiris had a sneaky C4 sitting on the ground. Looks like Ogre B lost track of it. Gonna lose a stock for it. Like, good, great recovery there for Osiris. Got wow, stuck, what though. an amazing combo! Yeah, got stuck there. Throw back and the C4 gonna blow his stock and clean up. Get out of here, but right now, Ogre Beast, see, he's got 90, now 111. Yeah, this recovery, try, tried to footstool him. That smash full charge! Oh, no. oh. <laughs> That uh, may be uh, the most dead a snake has ever been. That yeah. Was obliteration. That would have killed the man at like 20%, I think. Full yeah. charge, snake F smash, nothing to play around with. There's nothing to play around there. But So now you've got them trying to figure out what um, Ogre B, what does he want to do here? Uh, what? <laughs> Big Simon, yet yeah, another character that I've actually never seen Ogre B plot. He's I've just whipping never... out. This is his all or nothing move. This is his ace in the hole. He believes Simon is the character Three, to take Snake two, out. One, go. We'll see if he can make it work. Simon using the chain as much as possible here, in my opinion. Yeah, I think that the aerial moves having a great range to, so that he doesn't have to trade with Snake is actually a pretty pretty good idea. I think it's a phenomenal idea, especially because Osiris is already at 93%. Here's the trouble. Simon has a hard time recovering. Yeah. And Snake's the... great at exploiting that. So Ogreby needs absolutely needs to stay on the stage if he wants to uh, take this out here. Yeah, so far, so good in this matchup. Holy crap! And he's dead! He's dead! 
That F smash just barely caught him. And it's looking like it's almost all wrapped up here. For the yep, Osiris just needs to win this.